here with Big City Vegan and I am at the Green Festival in New York City and I am here with Brad of Brad Raw Foods. This is this is Brad. Hi Hello. Brad. <laughs> it's so exciting to see I you. Know. I know. I love your kale chips. They're amazing. So how did you get into making kale chips? What was inspiring you? Why not just... why not carrots? <laughs> Well, I came across the whole kale and my chips all through just going on a raw food diet. And I just um, went on a raw food diet about four years about four years ago and kind of completely changed my life. You know, I just went from uh, American standard diet to eating all raw and I lost weight and started feeling much better and so I would just make these chips for myself and then you know, one thing after another, I started selling it in the farmer's market. And next thing you know, I've been selling them in all the stores around the nation. You know? So you made the switch to raw vegan overnight? Overnight, 100% raw. What inspired you to do that? Just by reading a lot of books and, and seeing a lot of the other raw foodists that were doing it. You know, just, um, uh, just by reading their, their story, it kind of inspired me. So I knew what to expect. So I just went out 100% raw, and I went through the whole detoxing part of it. And then uh, is that hard? Because I what? hear people like going full, like from one to the other. It is. It is. There's a few weeks where you're not feeling it, right? Well, I was in bed basically. I took like two weeks off. I was just detoxing, you know, feeling bad, having headaches, breaking out, just everything that the book told me. But I, but I, um, you know, I kind of expected it. So it was a little bit easier. So I was. So I just. I spent those two weeks, three weeks, just de just detoxing, yeah. and then, you know, then I just started to really feel better. I mean, I just felt like my skin getting more clear, I was sleeping better at night, you know, and so everything just started to come into place. And once I had that feeling, I was just like, I'm not looking back. And then I started to lose weight, and I just felt better day by day. And then it's just like I stayed raw for one year, and. Uh, and then I, and then I, yeah, then I was raw for a couple of years, and then I started selling the chips, you know, and then, and then we started selling them in farmers markets, and I went to uh, small little health food stores, and we got into Whole Foods, and then we got went national in the last two and a half years, and kind of blew up. And then now I have a grand opening on my educational center at my new factory, which is in Bucks County, Pennsylvania. So tell me about that. What do you mean education? What are you guys going to be doing? Everything I just told you about that I went through and it really inspired me and helped me. It just, I feel like I'm giving it back now. So we opened up an education center to bring speakers in. I'll do talks. We have people like David Wolf coming into our place. He's coming in June 14th, David Wolf at our place. And we have Philip McCluskey coming in and doing a two day event. You know, that's someone that lost 200 pounds and changed his life. David Wolf into superfoods and just um, just educating people more about real food. <laughs> and uh, you know, we have a juice bar there, so we're getting the juicing now and uh, helping people with three-day cleanses, seven-day cleanses, and educating them through the pro through the process. That's great. So, and this is all in Bucks County, Pennsylvania. Bucks County, yep, Bucks County, Pennsylvania. And uh, it's it's Mother's Day weekend. It's the grand opening. And then it's going to be there. And then it's going to be, going yep, and yep. Education, we'll have different speakers. Different speakers yeah. two, three times a week oh, from there on out. You're going to so. get Bucks County on oh, the we're gonna get, map. We're going to be like, New York City. Where do you want to go now? If you're raw vegan, you go to Bucks County. Well, I want to get all the New Yorkers so they can come out to the country, get some fresh air, come out to Bucks County and spend the weekend, do a little retreat with us. You know what I mean? Go on, get some, take your shoes off and walk on some good earth out there. You know? That's so exciting. I know. Yeah. I wanted our friends out there right next door to you, and I really can't wait yeah. to go visit them. It is the most beautiful place ever. I was born and raised there. I love it. I really do. Bucks County is beautiful. Staying so. close to the earth and the source. You yes. get that connection with what Without you're a doubt. So hopefully all of you can come out to my grand opening. Wherever you are. May 12th and 13th, grand opening. We'd love to. If not, go to Facebook, The Chip Factory, and check us out online. We have some pictures of our new facility. It's awesome. Come out and check it out. Kale chips galore for everybody. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so much, Brad. Thank you. Great. <laughs>